ask about a question that I know has been dogging you guys for a week. Are you guys going to ask priorities, the, the, the super PAC affiliated with the president, president's own advisors, raise money for this super PAC? Are you going to ask them to not air this ad? Pull it from the web. It's not aired anywhere, but yeah, it's just pull it from the web. It, it seems like everybody's a little uncomfortable with it. Well, Why not just say don't run? Let me tell you. Let me tell you. This has been... Uh, perpetuated mostly by the Romney campaign. Let me tell you this, Chuck, the Romney campaign long ago uh, gave up their opinion to be pious on this ad and to be pious on any ad. Let's, let's examine an ad that we do know actually is running, not on the web and just on Fox News, uh, an ad that's actually on television that says Barack Obama has done away with the work requirement for welfare. welfare. That ad is nothing but a lie. Mitt Romney's entire presidential campaign right now is built around a lie. Okay, Mitt Romney's on that ad saying he approved it, and it's a lie. Okay, but is the rationalization is well they do it, so we're going to do it. No, no, no. I mean, Chuck, let's. I mean, let's be, you're, you're not no, no, saying. No. Are, are you comfortable with that ad? That no, no, right? but Chuck, let's How be about clear. You are you comfortable with that ad? Chuck, I don't have any control over that ad. I'm not part of Priority Super PAC. I've never raised money for Priority. You know, you attacked John Edwards once, and in, 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 during the, the primary campaign on a, on a 527 ad that attacked you guys, and you said, you know, John Edwards well, could call that 527 and stop doing it. Look. Because uh, look, I, I don't I don't remember or get into the John Edwards thing. I know this: you have uh, an ad that our campaign has nothing to do with, as you mentioned, is running uh, on YouTube. If you hit play, and an ad by Governor Romney, uh, approved by Governor Romney, that's nothing but a straight out lie, and not a lie that I say. A lie everybody said. There's a uh, op-ed uh, editorial in the Des Moines Register this morning. Uh, that says Mitt Romney is lying about the president on welfare. And, and, you know, Chuck, to have these guys fly around the country and pretend like we're going to have a campaign based on substance, that we're going to have some bold, high-minded, issue-based campaign, when the whole thing is centered around nothing but a lie, is a joke. And so you know, Romney I'm not hinted, lectured by Governor right. Romney. Governor Romney hinted to me that he would like some sort of truce. Uh, and he also, I think in a radio said, maybe it would be nice if every ad that got fact-checked as false got pulled. Would you guys sign an agreement like I'm that? I'm not sure. What, I, I, think, I think Mitt Romney would be up with shadow puppets right now. Mitt, <laughs> Mitt Romney's first ad. Well, you guys would agree Mitt, to something like that. Mitt if Romney's, you guys could come to an agreement about saying, you know what, maybe we got to come to... We, look, 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 let me tell you this. We'd be happy to look at what Governor Romney proposes just as soon as he takes down uh, the series of ads that every fact-checker that's looked at every single fact checker that's looked at him and said they're false. I mean, I, I appreciate the, you, you again, his piousness on this. His ad and his campaign are built nothing uh, but around a lie right now. Robert.